What is going on guys? Grave here. Today I'll talk about performance issues within the game and this has really been an issue for a long time. If you've played even players that started in the beta, of course I started the game about six months after it was, after it was released here on console. And there's been performance issues mainly in PvP, but there's been a good bit of performance issues in my opinion in PvE over the last couple of years. Before I get into all the details, be sure if you're not subscribed to the channel to hit the subscribe button. If you are a subscriber, make sure you have notifications turned on. If you enjoyed the video, I'd appreciate a like and check out everything down in the description the community discord my twitter and of course the affiliate here on the channel empire jerky the website along with the discount code you can use a checkout is linked in the description as well um when it comes to performance issues this has been a thing that a lot of players have wanted fixed for a really really long time a lot of players would i think rather have performance issue fixes instead of any dlc throughout the year and i made a video not long ago talking about you know should they kind of curb back the dlc for a while and do something like a you know kind of just a, a overall health thing for the game to kind of you know fix back-end problems to fix performance problems to fix ui problems and i mean in my opinion i think it would be a good idea if they did you know maybe performance fixes every year just instead of doing one dlc at, at a certain point just kind of change those dlcs to a different time and at that time frame that, that dlc would come out so let's take like the beginning of the year or the end of the year when these smaller dlcs come out just move those to somewhere else uh you could do it with the dungeons uh, that's kind of what i talked about in that other video just move the dungeons to all uh, kind of to all to one dlc at a certain time of the year and you know in that other time frame just work on games performance game issues that kind of thing um of course lately in the pts uh the patch notes um they have mentioned things making significant progress on performance and that's kind of a running meme when it comes to the uh the world of the elder scrolls online if you go online you go on reddit you go on twitter that's most of the memes you see is about performance and i do understand why players get frustrated with it and i understand also that it takes a lot of work to get things weren't running correctly on any game uh, it does not really matter the game how big how small if it's a, a F, an fps game if it's a mmo if it's an rpg Making things run correctly is not as easy as it seems, but at the same time, a lot of people that play the Elder Scrolls Online are kind of wondering why is it taking seven plus years, six plus years, you know, depending on what platform you play on, uh, to get any of these performance issues fixed. Like I said, mainly the big performance issues you see, of course, are, is in PvP, but there's been a lot of performance issues, in my opinion, at least on the console side here on PS4, in PvE even, as of late. So I'm really curious what you guys think. When they say, like I said, recently they've said that they're looking to make significant or they have made significant progress on performance. Is it just another one of those things like they've always said? I think that's how a lot of people take it. I think a lot of people really don't believe it. Because even here on my channel, I made a video about this. I think it was sometime after Somerset came out. So it's been a while talking about how they said that they're working on performance uh, throughout that year. And it's really not changed since then. I mean, it's still the same thing that a lot of us have experienced since that period or before that period of time. Um, I know PC has a lot of performance issues as well. Now, of course, I know performance is going to be different on, you know, if you have an old gen console compared to like a, maybe a PS5 or Xbox Series X, maybe with the enhanced version coming out for new gen consoles, some of the performance issues will be fixed. But just in general, even people with insanely great PCs out there still have some performance issues when it comes to PvP. Now, it may be kind of, you know, not as bad, I guess, in PvE for those some of those players. But just overall, I think a lot of the fan base, a lot of the players, a lot of the community, when they hear that they're making significant progress on performance, they don't really believe it. I, like I said, I think they just kind of laugh it off now. Like I said, it's because it's almost a meme when it comes to the Elder Scrolls Online. So leave me a comment with your thoughts. Do you think we're actually going to get some changes this time? I hope we do, but we'll kind of have to wait and see. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.